so many, so many times people will see a technique demonstrated online and they'll say, that'll never work. <laughs> right. Right. Well, what if I did this? <laughs> yeah, what if I did that? <laughs> well, if you did this, then I wouldn't have done that. Exactly. Of course. But the other thing is that the technique relies on a method of application, so of course the technique doesn't work. Right. There's no end now of videos of martial artists testing a technique that they saw on a video, mm. or they saw somebody do and then they test it at their own school to see if that technique works. Right. And I don't have a problem with that because often the person demonstrating the technique doesn't understand it either, and it's, they're just a totally compliant yep. partner doing it. But there's a method that's involved that neither, sometimes neither the person doing the demonstration nor the person copying the demonstration really understands. Right. So, so this, you know, if I just fold and I do that, of course that's not going to work, <laughs> right? Yep. But if you are catching my arm and I'm oh. responding to that, yep, that works. Right? but you have to be doing that for me to do this, yeah. and if you, and if, but if I do this, you're going to tell, and you're going to punch me in the face <laughs> right, if you're doing Tai Chi, or you're just going to let go if you're grappling, and you'll go for another grip. Even, even as a gut response, that's very probable yeah, for yeah. them to grip and punch you with your hand. Yeah, yeah, exactly, <laughs> even without technique. But now this, oh, yeah. you can't see this from the, with a camera, but that's just my finger, right? Yeah. So should we show the camera? Yeah, sure. Oh, I don't know. This is that. Now, there are different techniques that will do the same thing, yep. right? Or you might come to here, and then it becomes like that, yep. and or there, or you might roll over like this and then do that, okay? <laughs> so, or or the, the formal one, which is like that, okay? So, thank you. Yep. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. So, from here, there are so many variations that come from that position or that, that technique can lead to a whole bunch of different directions. Right. If you understand the method and the principle, then any number of things can happen from, from this position depending on what you're doing, but it's not based on you grabbing my arm. Right. right. It's based on energy going this way right. that you are resisting to and engaging and that I have to deal with. Yep. Right? But if I say, if I attack you and you grab my arm and I do this technique, <laughs> what's wrong? He didn't grab my arm. No, you're supposed to, it's like... Well, it should have worked. Yeah, it should have worked. Go ahead, grab my wrist. No, the other arm. No, palm down. No, the palm up. That, oh, God. <laughs> like this. Okay. Okay, now you're sorry. You know? <laughs> I have you now. Yeah, this kind of idea, like for instance this, this simple, we yeah. talked about this before. Ooh, that's a good one. Right? But if, if you know that's coming, yep. or if you don't know it's coming, and mm -hmm. you just don't want that to happen, yeah. then it's not going to happen. Just let go. Yeah. But, I ha but if I grab this and I, and I have you already. Oh yeah. Right? Ooh. There. So the technique works from a particular point. Right. But even here, yeah. if, you, if you know I'm going to try this technique, mm -hmm. and you have any Tai Chi skill, mm -hmm. then you just connect with the centripetal. There you you don't even have to do anything. No? No, just connect to the ground. Okay. Right? So centripetal engagement. Yep. OK, there you go. Now, now so, so do it to me. Yep, sure. So here, lock this finger. Yep. So you don't let, the idea is to not let my finger slide up the arm. Oh, OK, right on. OK, and this arm yep. is going to do the S-bend lock. OK. So from here, you yep. just Tri don't let my finger slide up. Okay. Okay. And you f roll over like that. There you go. Again, keep going. So you just sort of point at the ground. There you go. Okay. Now you're getting the idea. So this right. is connecting through here. Oh, I can see it. So think of t push hands principles. Yep. Think of Tai Chi principles and think about that engagement. Continue that engagement into my arm. There we go. Now, see, you move my feet. Yeah. So you've got the connection through the whole body I do. like that. So as you roll and point at my toes, uh, no, don't push forward. Sure. Just roll my arm. So the idea is to make me move me, right. not put, force me to go somewhere I don't want right. to go. Right, 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 right. You want to move me in a way that makes me want to get into that position, mm -hmm. and then I'm, I'm going to regret it, but I'm going to do it anyway. Right. 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 So that's kind of the nature of the method, right? Mm -hmm. You want to make the other person want to do it, or you right. find the part of their mind that wants to go there, or right. you find the resistance, the way that the resistance is working in a way, you let them do what they want to do right. in a way that gives you the result you want. Yes, okay? I got you. Right. But if you're just trying to make me do something I don't want to do, it's really going to be hard. You're just going to have to be really fast, or hit get me when I'm not looking, or punch me when I'm not blocking. <laughs> <laughs> so you have to find a way through that connective tissue to, there we go, yeah. there. So now- really a highway of resistance that you're looking for. Yes, and you want to move way. sort of behind and beside and in front of it. You want to manipulate around it. So, yeah. so like you, that's a very good way of putting it. So yeah. I'm looking at where, how, is, how does it connect to your ground? It, the, it's only going to connect through you through your f resistance. Right. Because if you don't resist, then I haven't got the lock on. Ah. But if you do resist, 
Then I've got it. Relax more. Just keep relaxing. <laughs> keep relaxing. Keep relaxing. <laughs> there. Oh no. I'm there we go. Okay. <laughs> so this is not just a matter of I'm going to do this and do that, yeah, yeah, and you're yeah, going yeah. to fall for it. Right. I have to understand the nature of this connection and this connection and this connection and that connection right. and my own connection. So now it becomes me. Mm -hmm. So when I do this, if yeah. I want to have the mechanical advantage, mm -hmm. I have to have done some Zhang and some forms and some. You know, some really serious meditation and introspection, so that I understand the own, my own mechanical efficiency, and then I find oh, yours. Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So this isn't from me going like this or pushing yeah, harder. Yeah, yeah. It's me. I just, I just look for the understanding, and oh, okay, there he is. Then you're looking for the understanding, and oh, no. you, you <laughs> almost understood your way right out of it. You, yeah, I did. You did kind of neutralize it, right? A little, yeah. So you're understanding your way out of the situation. Yeah, yeah totally. Uh, oh, other, oh. Otherwise, because <laughs> so much of, of self-defense, so much of interpersonal relationships mm -hmm. is about whether or not you understand the position you're in. Right. And fear and anger are sort of the enemy of that. Mm. Right. So when you get antagonistic towards your opponent, you end up giving them the thing that you're trying <laughs> to protect yourself from. Right. So here comes the punch. Oh, no, you're going to you know, get fixated on the punch. Right. Right? The old Taquan story, you know, you get attached to the weapon or the timing or the distancing or whatever. Mm -hmm. So, but from here, this is my little finger. Oh, man. Okay? That's my little finger <laughs> yeah, and this thumb. Yeah. Right, that. So, so this is not a lot of... Oh, man, yeah. I could feel okay? it. But you see how easy that is. Yeah. Okay? But this requires precision. It does. Okay? It's like... Uh, Mm -hmm. It's like John playing the guitar, talking about why he doesn't have any calluses on his fingers. <laughs> and he's been playing hours and hours a day for decades, right. and he has no calluses on his fingers. Ah. Because he only touches the string when it's necessary. Right. Yeah. And he only touches in the way that's necessary. So I, I play for five minutes, and my fingers are sore. Right, because you're white knuckling. I've got, I've got to go, that one, and that one, and he's just feeling his way through it, right? The guitar <laughs> plays itself. Right. Yeah. And, uh, so, so from here, like this, no, there, just like that, you want to go right over the wrist. Right. You want to stop the fingers from sliding up your arm. Yeah. There you go, because that's how I'm going to get away, right? Yeah. See, how, see how my fingers are fighting that way? You could take that finger, or that finger, or that finger, or right. that finger. You could just take the little finger, mm -hmm. like Dr. Yang Zhuang Ming, the pinky collector, right. as yeah. he said. So, and now you just roll into that. There, but in a way that isn't attacking my wrist, it's attacking my center through the wrist. So you connect through the wrist. There you go. And as you roll like that, you just sort of file through it. Shoulders down, elbows dropping, feel the connection to your core. There you go. Mm -hmm. See how the connection to your core improved that? Yes, it did. Okay. So now I can try to move this way, and you steer it. I try to move this way. You uh, too much. Sorry. So, you know, there you go, just like that. If you go too far, I'm, I'm back here again. Oh, I see. Right? Yeah. So you have to be precise. It's like balancing on that. Right. On the edge of the, there we go. It's like a razor's edge floating on a log, floating in the water. 90 degrees, it's easy. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> You're giving me a level plane here. Yeah, the, the trick is to get to this position. Right? Now, but even if you are in this position, if I have better principle than you, mm. okay, so this is, do that again. Yep. So there I'm using external so you can see it. But from here, you apply that pressure. As you, if, you, if you drill right into me, Right? And you're trying to just bypass my resistance a little bit, and you're breaking the joints up like that. Yeah. If I can connect it into the ground again. Haha, <laughs> I can feel it. That's amazing. Right? So now yeah, that, that happened. 